Okay, so you decided to uh, jailbreak your PS4, and you got the debug settings, and you were browsing through it and decided to do the IDU thing because, you know, you were curious to see what the hell it was. Well, I'm, I did the same thing, so don't feel too stupid. Well, I mean, I am stupid, so feel stupid. Um... <laughs> It's actually quite easy to get out of it. It took me a couple of days to for it to pop in my head. But it's it's really easy. So first of all, it's going to when you turn it on, it's going to restart your computer or I mean your sorry, your PS4. It's going to come up to a screen where it's saying uh something about IDU, please it'll probably say this. But you're not going to see this at all. It's just going to be a blank screen. What you have to do is you got to put it in staff mode. So you have to hold R1, R2, L1, L2, option, and up. You hold it in for, I don't know, a, a couple of seconds or so. Just hold that in until this appears and it'll say that uh it'll say like welcome to staff mode or something like that now all you have to do is go into your internet settings sorry network settings set up internet connection now i'm not going to do it simply because i don't want to show everything that i'm doing but you do it the same way that you did it to jailbreak the PS4. Well, no, jailbreak it. So you do the same thing. The same exact setup. Once you do that, just go to the home screen, go to settings, go to user guide, and your exploit will come up. Now all you gotta do is go to your specific uh, software, so on 5.05, .05, go to hen, load that, yeah, yeah, not enough space, blah, blah, blah. And once it says success, just exit out, go to debug settings, it's it's really it's this simple. I've only found one other video that showed how to get out of it. But it's it's a lot more simpler than what he said. Though I would I would say thank you to him because if it wasn't for his video at all, I would have thought that I would have got rid of my PS4 basically. I would have thought you can't get out of it at all. But all you have to do is go to debug settings. Go down to system, D, IDU mode, and you can turn it off. It's, it's really, it's that simple. That's all you have to do. Okay, it'll restart the system, and it'll be right back to the way it was before. Now, if you're, when you first turn it on, if for whatever reason, if the... If putting it in staff mode doesn't work, all you have to do is turn off the PS4, hold in the power button until the second beep, and that'll put you into, um, what's it called, safe mode. Now what you're going to do from there, it sucks, but there's, from what I know, there's nothing else you can do. You have to go to restore system uh, de to default settings. You won't lose any of your games. It's just going to put it all back to system default settings. That's it. Once that happens, turn it back on. Do the same thing. L2, L2, R2, R1, R2, options, button, and up. That's all you got to do. Hold them in. It'll put it in staff mode and then follow what I told you to do 
Now, if you restore, if you restore the system, well, yeah, never mind. You probably already know that. User guide. And I'm back. That's all you have to do. It's that simple. Alright, that's it.